Hello there, welcome to my cha 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 channel. <laughs> so today I'm reviewing the Ellen's Flats All Seed Savory Crisp. So I guess it's nut free, and I would imagine it's gluten free. It's made in sunny Florida, plant based whole food, good source of fiber, grain free, sugar free. Um, so there's no grains. I would imagine it's gluten free. Did I just say that? <laughs> well, I didn't say that. But I think they're gluten-free. Um, and, yeah, so it's like you can put all kinds of stuff on here. Are they all have the same picture on the back? Yeah, pretty much. And I got all kinds of flavors. And um, you can get this at Central Market in Austin, Texas. You can also order it online directly from them. So if you don't want nuts and uh, you want something different... And I want to say gluten-free. Maybe it's just not certified. Maybe it's made in a facility with, you know, maybe that's why they're not saying it. But it says grain-free. Excuse me. I was raw vegan for a long time. And I used to get, like, stuff like this from a company called Flackers. It was, like, flaxseed. But um, let's just get right in it, shall we? We've got all kinds of flavors. We've got cumin. we got caraway seed. Hemp everything and sesame and my roommate has been munching on these and it looks like he likes the hemp one because there's not much left all right so which one should we try first but i want to show you which is what he hasn't even eaten yet it looks like some of these he hasn't eaten a lot of Did he even open this so you get a lot like a lot i mean like a lot a lot i think so so, which one shall we try first? How everyone's doing today, by the way? Let me know in the comments, like, how you're doing. Um, I'll just go with the hemp, since... Oh, he still left me quite a bit. Well, kind of. And this has pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seed's really good, especially for men, because men need extra zinc. Sunflower seeds, flag seed, hemp seed. Psyllium, that's good for the fiber. That probably help holds it together. Poppy seeds, less than 2% of black pepper. Pink salt. So pink salt is on the bottom, so hopefully they're not that salty. Mmm. Compared to the flackers and other, like, healthy crackers made with seeds that can sometimes be, like, really hard and... You know, this is more airy and crunchy. Delightful. But so hardy, but not too hardy because, you know, seeds lighter than nuts. And tons of omega-3. Put hummus on it. All kinds of stuff. Avocado. Mmm. Avocado would glue it on here. Really, really good. And not too salty. Um, it has like a light roasted taste. So what else? Let's just try what is everything. What is another one? I'll just try everything. Yeah. I'm trying to show you what looks like the whole one. Because some of these got like cracked. Oh, here it is. Okay, that smells like really garlicky and... Yeah, oniony and garlicky. This is sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, flax seeds, sesame seeds, black seeds, poppy seeds, psyllium husk, onion, pink Himalayan salt. This is even more crispier and lighter. I like just more black pepper and onion. More flavor. And so far, the hemp is my favorite. Mmm. This is so good. What else? So, yeah, I live in Texas. It's, like, really warm today. Um, 
I was supposed to get an MRI done last month, but lack of communication, not on my part, but with, with my pain management clinic and the hospital that I'm supposed to get the MRI and then giving me misinformation. I never got it done last month. Well, this is really pretty the way this one is. Look at that. I'm not, I don't think it stinks, but I'm not too crazy about the smell of this one. It doesn't stink, though. What is this, sesame? I don't really like sesame seeds. Pumpkin seeds, sunflower seed, flag seed, sesame seeds, psyllium, poppy seed, less than 2% less than of black pepper and salt. I really like the fact that these are not very salty. I love the fact that they are not. Mmm. I love sesame seeds, but maybe they're just baked too long. They seem to be baked a little too long, taste-wise. I'm not too crazy about that one. It's not bad, but I wouldn't use it again. Not when I have those other two that are really good. Now we're down to these two. So yeah, um, I have to see my doctor Monday. And here is, what, Tuesday today, I believe? And I still am waiting for them to call me back. Because then they fact... They, oh, this is a long story. They supposedly faxed it over. Then they didn't. And then they had the wrong fax. And then the, and the last thing I found out is they only faxed over the notes and not the order. So what's next? Let's do cumin. Oh, that's really strong. Cumin. Yeah, my roommate left a lot, lot in here. He probably only ate one because... Oh my goodness, is it strong. Psyllium husk, sunflower seed, flag seed, sesame seed, cumin seed, not the powder. That's interesting. And then 2%, you know, or less of black seed and uh, salt. Oh, there is a lot. I know what cumin seeds look like, and there's a lot. I like toasted cumin seed, like an Indian food. Oh, it's so good. Especially when you make rice. Oh, so good. I love cumin seed, but I like it. I don't love it. It's really strong in the cumin. I'm getting really airy and crispy. And not, not hard and crunchy, but airy and crispy. I'm not too crazy about this one, how it, um, the way it breaks down your mouth and your palate. Um, this is the caraway seed. I'm imagining it's the same. pumpkin seed, sunflower seed, flax seed, sesame seeds, caraway seeds, psyllium, 2% or less of salt, and black pepper. Let's see how many caraway seeds are on here. Oh, this is a big one. Oh, I guess someone took a bite out of it. You know, I can make, when it comes to caraway seed, I can make raw vegan bratwurst when you put caraway seed in it, and it's so good. Mmm. Oh, but it's strong on the caraway seed. I can see a lot of people, if they're not heavy on the caraway seed, they're not going to like this. Because it's not a touch. It's really... But I prefer this over the uh, sesame. Mmm. You know, I reviewed some vegan brie cheese. That will go good on here, I think. Well, I'm, I'm all of them, really. Most of them. And tree line... A vegan cream cheese would also good on here. The Borzen vegan cream cheese or cheese that I also reviewed on my channel would go good on here. I think it's really heavy on the caraway. And so I'm not too crazy about the sesame 
the cumin was really strong too. Mm. My favorite one is the one that my roommate was eating most of, the hemp. And I don't like, hemp sometimes tastes, mm, this does not taste like hemp, you know? Hemp. Um, yeah, I like the hemp a lot. I thought I had more. Where's the rest? Maybe this is it. Um, I'm crazy about the sesame. Cumin was really strong. The cumin might be good with, like, if you make, um, something that has cumin in it, but then don't add the cumin because there's cumin on there. Like, um, guacamole, but don't add any cumin and put the guacamole that's cumin-free on that and get the cumin from the chip, but I don't know. I will definitely buy the hemp, like, all the time. Like, this is going to be my cracker of choice now. And then probably the everything as well. I just can't get over how light, airy these are. Let's look at them again, shall we? But this is not the prettiest one. The other ones are more prettier, but it tastes the best. I just like that they're thin. The flackers are really thick. You know, just flaxseed, which is really healthy. A lot of people say that if you don't break the flaxseed, I pulverize it. You either can't break it down, break it down very little, don't get the nutritional value, or get very little of it. I want to buying these way more often. Really good. I wanted to get into story time, but basically, well, yeah. A lot's been going on with me. I may have to move. Not have to, but I may move. Other than that, I'm just dealing with the same stress with doctors and hospitals like I always seem to deal with. Um, so until next time, please comment, like, subscribe. Let me know what other foods you want me to try, but that's only for my subscribers. So if you have any requests... And then also don't forget to look below the video because there you will see my Patreon and some other stuff too. I'm going to start adding so you can uh, find a way to support this. So I can show you how you can support this channel. So until next time, have an awesome day. And I'm seriously like, oh, on a scale of 1 to 10, the, uh, what was it? The hemp. I'm going to give this a solid 8.8 .8 out of 10. And I'm definitely going to keep buying this one. All right, have an awesome day. Bye-bye.